who we can get there. All right. The attendance policy, as you know, has not been um, has not been enforced of late, and uh, we have decided that we are going to begin enforcing the attendance policy. And the the language in the attendance policy that was placed in front of you tonight has not changed. This is the same attendance policy that has been in effect since November 25th of 2013. The draft I have has changes in it. What changes? The policy oh. is three consecutive regular meetings and or work sessions, or four total meetings and or work sessions. No, I believe we took work sessions so out. Right? We took we that from our side. Yeah, we deleted work sessions. Uh, That's I'm correct. I'm looking at the draft from May 20th. So okay. Yeah, I'm sorry, we did take work sessions out. Okay. The one change we did is um, in differentiating between an excused absence and a non excused to me. If you're not here, we assume you had legitimate business. I mean, it's not third okay. grade. So um, if we'll just remove that language for work sessions. I mean, I would love to be able to enforce that, but we obviously can. So uh, three consecutive meetings or four meetings over the course of the year? Regular meetings. Regular meetings. Correct. Um, so we will begin enforcing that as of January 1st. I believe we already have a couple of members who are not in compliance. So moving forward, that will be <coughs> All right. We'll need a motion. All right. So retroactive to this past January or not to take effect until next January? No. Beginning this January year. of 2019. Okay. So retroactive. You don't feel like they could retro back to the January this year four months ago. Yes. Is that where you would say that, Matt? I just wanted which January are we talking about? No, beginning. I mean, is there any discussion on that? Do you guys want to start today? I don't have anyone out of compliance yet. We have one. We've that. Yeah, we've talked about that there. Three consecutives, we have one. All right. Do we need a motion then to? Uh, well, I, I don't want to. I don't want to make. I don't think we need to make it retroactive. I think we need to make it start today. I mean, you know. But the only thing, Commissioner Hall, is it's, it's not we didn't make a change. It's no. always been there for for six years now. Right. Oh, okay. We just had to enforce it. All right. You know, we've talked about enforcement for the last four years. Yeah. I know, yeah. <laughs> Okay. So we're not changing anything. I can offer it. Yeah, the policies, the same policies. Been Point well taken. So, I don't know that we need a, what is it, Matt? I don't know if you had a. I'm just looking at my own attendance log and okay. I don't have we any can, one with three in a row. Okay, we can discuss that. Okay. Um, so I don't believe, I mean, we're not updating the policy. I don't believe we You're need right. We're updating position. the language of the document. <laughs> Obviously, I think I'll be a motion second vote. Okay. It's an effective date. All right. Madam Chair. Yes. Why would you say uh, we have somebody that's not in the step, but we'll talk about it later. The, the commissioner. <laughs> And if that is the case, then why are you having to leave? In other words, what I'm saying is when we have a meeting and you say someone is not doing this and not doing that, but we don't want to put it on the on the floor and say who it is, then why waste the other members' time? Well, I think it's pretty obvious who it is. Um, and the point of the discussion was that the attendance policy, which has been into a, been in effect for a number of years, has just not been enforced. I, I, re I respect Commissioner McClendon's statement. I think maybe it's clarification. It was, the attendance record had been established in the track. So it was just a matter of record that there may be someone who was not in compliance. It was not really, it's not really germane to this discussion, right? Yeah. Probably should have not been brought up. Probably not. You're right. And, and, and so when we have these things, as I'm sitting, when we have these things that we cannot put that on the table, mm -hmm. you're right. we should reconsider putting it on the table. I agree. Mm -hmm. I agree. All right. Madam Chair, I would make a motion that we adopt the current language of the attendance policy as it is written here tonight. <coughs> And uh, 
we begin enforcing the attempt to file the per those terms and definitions. All right. All right. We have a motion. All those in favor of the motion, raise your right hand. All those opposed? We have one abstaining. Oh, just adopting the policy of Commissioner McClendon. Okay. That was in favor. In favor? Okay. Then that is a unanimous. All righty. We're going to have to hurry up by running out of there. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, yes. You're right. We are. Right. <laughs> 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 Thank you. 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 Thank you.